What's up guys, it's Shanice. Welcome back to my channel. So as you can see, my hair is straight. Yeah, if you guys follow me on Snapchat, you guys would have already seen it from time. Um, yeah, everything goes on there first or my vlog channel. So definitely go follow me and subscribe to my vlog channel. But yeah, so today I'm going to show you guys how I straighten my hair. It's pretty much the same as last year. And as you guys know, or some of you guys may know, I only straighten my hair once a year. Even though I kind of want to do it twice a year just because it's so easy. I don't have to do anything to it literally throughout the week except wrap it. But yeah, I usually go like three weeks to a month with my hair straight and it lasts. So I'm going to show you guys how I do it. If you guys are interested, just keep watching. And if you enjoy, give it a big thumbs up. It does help me. So yeah, I will see you guys on the next video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you guys know every time I upload a new video. Deuces! All right, so first things first, I did shampoo and condition my hair just with any conditioner and shampoo that I had lying around my house, nothing special. And then I went on to my extreme deep conditioner. Um, I do have a video on this, which I will link down below, but I made sure to use a mixture of protein and moisture that is very important before I straighten my hair. And then I went in with blow drying. This is the paddle brush blow dryer, which I highly recommend to cut your blow drying time in half. It's amazing, it's affordable, and it just makes everything so much easier. As you can see, I sort of just blew through this and it got my hair really, really straight. My hair was looking hella bomb. So if you guys are interested in that review, I will link it down below and it will pop up on the card screen. But you guys cannot tell me that my hair does not look bomb. I would actually rock it in this nice fro or this nice blown out state. Like, girl, who am I? Anyway, so now onto the important part. I am using my Chi Iron 44 Guard and I'm just spraying that all over my hair. This is a new product. I usually just use a serum, but this time I'm like, let me protect my hair and see if it makes a difference. And then I went in with my all time favorite product. This is the Chi Silk Infusion serum thingy and I use this in all of my straight hair videos if you guys have been following me and I like to use a generous amount because I do have a lot of hair or a good amount of hair so I'm just gonna put that all over my hair and um, yeah really just work it in and this is gonna give me smooth hair shiny hair less frizz and it's just gonna make my hair really nice and silky all right, so onto the star of the show. This is actually a new flat iron that I decided to try out. It is from Vanity Planet. This is their Vanity Planet Tame Flat Iron, and I can say that I really, really do like it. So yeah, first things first, this does not look like any other flat iron that I own. Even the grip on it is just different, the material of it. Like, it's just weird, it's different, and it gives you like a really nice grip, so I do appreciate that. And it also has titanium plates and an ionic generator, which gives you more shine softness and body and that's exactly what I got which you guys will see in my final results and the main reason why I love this straightener is because it has the adjustable temperature and I usually do my temperature um, on 450 every time I straighten my hair but I really want to test out how good this straightener was so I'm like let me try it on 420 and it still got my hair really really straight so if you guys are interested in this straightener I will leave my code somewhere on the screen and there will be a link down below in, this, in the description box. So I'm just sectioning off my hair in the back and I usually like to start from the back. It just, I don't know, just makes sense. So I'm using small sections and I'm making sure that my hair is nice and detangled. And I use the chase method. So pretty much I use my flat iron and then I chase with the comb. And that makes sure that I get all of my hair strands so I don't have any poofiness or puffiness at the end. I really want all of my hair to, you know, be straightened in this process. So this just makes things a lot easier and my hair comes out bomb every single time. And I do like to trim my ends every time I'm finished with a section. And because I did straighten my hair not too long ago, I don't have a lot to cut off. But yeah, I'm just going to do the same thing to the next side. I'm just going to go in with my flat iron and then chase with my comb. And this is going to give me the most smooth and sleek results. Okay, so turning around, I am taking another small section and doing the same exact thing. I'm going to comb through my hair and then go in with my tame flat iron. And honestly, with this flat iron, I just need to do one pass. Sometimes on the roots, I'll go one to two times, but usually I just need to do one. And my hair still looks really, really straight. And 
as you can see, I examined my ends on each section and right there I had a bit to cut off and I like just to do this throughout each section because at the end of it, I really want my hair to look nice and healthy all the way through. I don't want it to look really great from the top and then when you get to the end, it's like, girl, what are you doing? So I like to trim my hair throughout the whole process. It just makes things a lot easier. So this is what my hair looks so far. I'm really loving how soft and shiny it is. It's really smooth. So I'm definitely impressed with this straightener. Another tip I want to give is that you don't want to overdo it with product in your hair because that's gonna weigh your hair down. One, it's gonna look like a hot mess. Two, your hair is gonna look super oily and it probably won't last as long if you add way too much product. So I like to make sure that my hair is nice and deep conditioned before. And then I use just a little bit of serum and heat protect it and that's it and four you can actually do more damage to your hair you can give yourself heat damage or you can actually just fry your hair by using way too much product so yeah i'm just going to speed this up for you again just making sure that each section is nice and detangled and then i'm going to do the chase method with my straightener and my fine tooth comb Okay, so once all the back section's done, you can see I have this front section right here, and this is when I start doing my hair vertically. As you can see, I'm making my parts vertically, and then I'm straining my hair that way. And this is just gonna make sure that my hair lays properly, because if I started doing them all backwards, it just wouldn't look right. So yeah, when I get to the front section, I'm just gonna part my hair vertically so I can have my hair laying where I want it to be. And at this point is where I decided that I want to be Morticia and have a middle part going right down the middle. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right here. And then pretty much breaking my hair up into smaller sections and doing the chase method as usual. And don't be alarmed by all that steam. That's just the product and the flat iron working together. My hair is not frying. My hair is not, you know, gonna drop off. It's all good in the hood, okay? All right, so to finish it off, I'm just gonna make sure to get my edges because that usually frizzes up the fastest for me, especially because I wash my face often, water, sweat, all of that usually gets a hold of my edges. So I'm just gonna make sure to flat iron those real, real good. And that is pretty much it. No, I lied. Again, I'm going in with my Chi Silk Infusion and I'm putting a good amount of that all over my hair, especially focusing it on my ends because my ends were like, they weren't dry or anything, but it's the driest part of my hair and I really wanted my hair to last. So yeah, that is pretty much it. As you can see, these are my results. My hair is silky, smooth, shiny, and is looking real, real healthy. Um, this is actually the length of my hair right now. It's pretty much underneath my boobs, which I'm... Um, you know, I'm kind of happy with because I just cut my hair not too long ago. So I'm impressed by how much my hair has grown. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, if you guys want to see how I maintain my hair for a whole entire month, let me know by thumbsing up this video and I will see you guys all in the next video. Thumbs up for healthy hair. Yes. Deuces.